Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Praise Master Jesus. Praise Master Jesus. I use this opportunity to welcome each and everyone joining and connecting in the mighty name of Jesus. The Bible says, It's another beautiful day that the Lord has made that we should rejoice and be glad. This particular person was told to leave you. Someone stopped this person. Someone stopped this particular person. They gave this person advice to stay away from you in the name of Jesus. I've come to speak to somebody. A lot of us has been in the same position because words, wrong words, evil words and negative words was misinterpreted to our destiny helper and to people that were willing to stand the gap to bless us. A lot of us, under the sound of my voice, the reason why we are still limited is because a lot of wrong interpretation matakuna kadia but today the Lord says someone someone went at your back behind your back advising this person that God have sent into your life to let you to let you go praise master Jesus just because of envy but the Lord revealed to redeem the Bible says three nations gang up against Jehoshaphat. Jehoshaphat said, I know the secret and the corridor. I know how to ascend. The place is the corridor. Jehoshaphat went to death before the Lord in prayers. In the name of Jesus, there are a lot of destiny that has been limited because of wrong interpretations. There are people that they themselves are the one that have put themselves in that particular situation because they can't keep secret. Praise Master Jesus. A lot of people run their mouth. They talk everything. They have no secret. But to some, innocently, people decided to pledge that you will not rise in the name of Jesus. Today, I bring you the word of God. Wheresoever you're watching or connecting under the sound of my voice, I want you to key by faith and connect on this particular prophetic word. And believe me, child of God, in the name of Jesus, the Lord is making a way for you. The Bible says, Can a father give stone to the child when he asks for bread? Can he give snake to the child when he asks for fish? If a man knoweth how to give forth good things to his own children, what more about me as a father to you? The, the Bible says in the book of Jeremiah, I know the plan I have for you, the plans of good, thought of good, not of evil. So God has his own plan for you. And the Bible also says in the book of Chronicle, who is that one that speaketh forth the word upon your life? Another version that make it a decree and it come to pass when I, the Lord, I have not spoken. Child of God, listen to me. Whenever people go at your back, backbite and speak evil words against you, what you need to do is to rush at the corridor, at the corridor of prayers, not tears, not gossip. Talk to your God at the place of prayers. The Lord has sent me to speak to somebody boldly, confidentially, 100% with assurance that in the name of Jesus, anyone that has been fighting to bring your life down, I don't care to know the method of which you are using to talk to your destiny helper, to talk to people that have decided to help you. But the Lord says today in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, wheresoever you're watching or connecting, Wheresoever you're watching or connecting, in the name of Jesus, 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 there is nothing too hard for our God to do. Anyone that has gang up against you, may God intervene in the name of Jesus. Anyone that is advising your husband to leave you, may the Lord intervene. Anyone advising your business partner to stop doing that business with you, may God intervene. Anyone that is gossiping, calling an enmity in your marital status, in your life, may God intervene. My prayer for somebody today, anyone speaking at your back, trying to bring you down, may our God intervene. May our God intervene. May our God intervene. For in Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen and amen. Please, family, do not go without dropping a prayer point at the comment section. Like this particular prophetic word. Make sure you're blessing someone for in Jesus' name. Amen and amen.